Welcome into the BSN Buffs Position Preview Series. I'm Allie Monroy here with Jake Shapiro, and today we are going to be talking about the corner position. Jake, what do you think about CU's corner situation so far? Well, they're trying to get corner back to how good they were last year. Uh, they were terrific last year, but they lost a lot of those players, obviously. Uh, Akela Witherspoon and uh, Chidobe Ouzie, both going to the NFL. Tedrick Thompson, the safety, that still affects your corners. Uh, Isaiah Oliver, technically not a returning starter, but he was huge last year, and he's going to be their star corner this year. If Anthony Julemis isn't available, who do you think will step in for him? I mean, Julemis was the guy we thought was going to start at that second corner position alongside Oliver because uh, Julemis played a lot last year athletic. He's a weapon for the Colorado Buffaloes, but going through some uh, legal issues. And who do I think? Well, guess what? It's you. Dofia, Trey Udofia. I think Trey Udofia will probably be the guy who starts alongside uh, Isaiah Oliver. He's, he, he played today with the ones, and, and he's looked really good from all reports. We've talked to him, and he seems like he's starting to get the drift of the position and playing uh, a big-time college football role. What do you think the depth chart would look like behind Udofia? I think Dante Wigley is going to make an impact on this team at some point, and I'm not scared to see him on the field. I was a little bit in spring, but it seems like that transition from junior college ball to where he is now. Uh, we saw Ronnie Blackman make a few nice plays today as well, but there is not a lot of depth at this corner position like there was in the past, at least in terms of really high caliber talent. It's Isaiah Oliver, then there's a drop off, then there's guys like Trey Udofia, Dante Wigley, and then another drop off. After CU last year was one of the top teams in the country against the pass, what is a realistic expectation for CU right now? Well, uh, that's a good question, and I think that's the question many Buffs fans are asking. And It's really hard, not only because of the guys they lost, but because they have a new corners DB's coach and Shadon Brown. They have a new defensive coordinator, DJ Elliott. Uh, Isaiah Oliver is going to do so much for this defense because yeah. that's what a shutdown corner can do. The corner position is not one of my biggest worries. The corner position I think will be okay, especially with Mike McIntyre being a DB coach over the course of his career. A very good one at that. I think they're going to be okay on the outside. It's the inside that concerns me more. So when you ask what's their pass defense going to look like, I think it's still either middle of the road or top of the Pac-12. I'm not too concerned about their pass defense. Well, that's all for today. I'm Ali Monroy with Jake Shapiro, BSN Buffs.